Water quality efforts are a big lift in rural and urban areas. But as the saying goes, many hands make burdens lighter. Teamwork and collaboration fuel solutions quicker than we can as individuals. One collaboration paving the way for faster and more meaningful water quality improvements is the Iowa Agriculture Water Alliance. More after this. My name is Will Corman with Tri-C Farms in Hardy, Nebraska. Data became a huge thing 10 years ago and they just slowly been building more and more, collecting it. So the big question is, well, how are you gonna get that data to work for you? With the crop insurance side of it, the one way to, to make that data work for you is take that yield data and that planning data and plug that in. You build up that database through yield history, then obviously that's gonna help your bottom line as far as helping you sleep at night by having those guarantees a little higher. Comprised of farmers, ag retailers, and other partners, the Iowa Ag Water Alliance advocates for the adoption of conservation practices and other innovations to improve water quality. Executive Director Sean McMahon tells the State of Soy that a new initiative involving the work of conservation agronomists can get more ag retailers joining the conservation conversation. The Iowa Agriculture Water Alliance is so pleased to be partnering with the Iowa Soybean Association on what we think is a really important strategy to get the ag retail sector more involved in delivering conservation to their farmer customers. So one way to do that is by embedding these positions that we're calling conservation agronomists directly with ag retail outlets McMahon says the conservation agronomists employed by the Iowa Soybean Association will work firsthand in getting more information about conservation to employees working with farmer customers. McMahon says this is the first step in working conservation into farmers' agronomic systems. How can you integrate conservation into an agronomic system that includes fertilizer management, crop protection, so we can help farmers not only improve yields and profitability, but also very importantly, environmental outcomes from these different conservation practices. So the conservation agronomists really function as a conservation force multiplier for, uh, for ag retail. The National Fish and Wildlife Foundation just awarded the Iowa Ag Water Alliance a grant to employ a new conservation agronomist in Northwest Iowa. This position joins several other conservation agronomists already at work here in Iowa, as well as Nebraska, Minnesota, and Indiana. These partnerships, McMahon says, is how improvements are achieved. We have a number of ag retail partners, but also other agribusinesses that are getting their farmer customers involved in conservation. So the conservation agronomist piece really fits in well with the other public-private partnerships in our strategy to essentially leverage ag retail's trusted relationships with their farmer customers to drive adoption of more conservation practices.